Hey guys, Michael from Copper vs Glass, and I am a huge fan of mobile gaming. Whether that's racing, shooting, strategy, I'm just a fan of that pick up and play style. However, there is a problem when using your device. As you can see here, I'm playing Real Racing 3, I'm getting into a bit of a muddle, and I've pressed the multitasking and gone into the Play Store. And here on my iPhone 7 Plus, playing an action or first person shooter, I'm not necessarily sure the best way to actually hold the device that's going to feel comfortable for those longer periods of gaming. You can either move the device down or you can shuffle it up, but either way, mobile phones these days are getting way expensive and you don't necessarily want to drop it just because you're playing a game. Well, I think I found the solution. So this here is the Mobile Grip and it's a $14.90 add-on that comes in two different colours, Tidal Blue and also Candy Red, that can massively help improve gaming on mobile. It basically helps by giving you that grip, get it, grip like, that grip performance that you would normally get with something like an Xbox controller or a PlayStation controller, basically just helping you to hold your device without actually having to touch your phone. And for something so simple, it definitely helps out when using a slippery phone like the iPhone 7 Plus. Now in regards to the actual mobile grip itself, as you can see here it is very simple and it is completely made of plastic. Now even these bits on the side which I initially thought were going to be rubber are plastic but it still helps to grip your device quite nicely. Now it has this spring mechanism to help you easily fit your device in and it's going to fit anything from a 4.7 inch up to a 6.7 inch device. Now it does also come with a locking mechanism on the back so once you pull it out you can actually lock it in place completely so it allows you to more easily slide your device in. Now for me this didn't necessarily work out all that well as there wasn't a precise grip that fitted the iPhone 7 Plus perfectly. However, as you can see here, the phone itself fits in very nicely, however there is a little bit of give with the actual device itself as I mentioned. So you can actually push on the bottom and it is going to slide up and also down, but once you're actually playing a game that doesn't really make too much difference and you do have to put a little bit of force on it to actually get it to move, but overall it's a really nice fit and it makes it extremely comfortable. And there's not really too much more to it. Playing a game like Modern Combat 5, which is a first person shooter, just feels a lot more comfortable using the mobile grip as opposed to trying to hold the device itself. It allows you to take more of your hand off of the device and onto the grip, which definitely helps for gameplay as you really want to concentrate just on your thumbs, which is the main portion of your hand that's actually going to be touching the screen. Now don't get me wrong, I know that this is nowhere near the quality that you're going to get with a standalone controller like an Xbox or PlayStation controller, however it does massively improve any game that you want to play. Now if you're still using a game with an accelerometer like a racing game for example, it can still be a little bit awkward and you may have to tweak with the settings within the game, but in general it still gives you a better grip than what you're going to get holding your device. But that's going to do it guys for this video, now let me know in the comments section down below or on Twitter at Copper vs Glass if you guys are currently playing any awesome mobile games that you want me to check out or feature in an upcoming video. If you enjoyed this video be sure to give it a thumbs up down below and also down there in the description is going to be the link so you can purchase a mobile grip for yourself. Now if you know a mobile gamer and obviously with it coming up to Christmas this is a no brainer and I would definitely recommend picking it up for the low price that it currently is. For more great content don't forget to subscribe. I'm Michael from Copper vs Glass. I'm going to get back to some gaming but I'll see you guys in the next video.